Professor Balthazar's town, there was a lovely zoo. And in it lived Charlie the penguin, who was everyone's favorite. Charlie was always willing to amuse the visitors with his merry dance. He knew what each visitor liked best, and that was exactly what he would do for him. There was no one for whom Charlie did not enjoy dancing, but most of all, he liked to dance for Professor Balthazar, who would in return buy him a lemonade with lots and lots of ice, just the thing for a penguin. However, deep in his heart, Charlie had a great problem. He couldn't fly. Whenever he watched his cousins, the other birds, as they flew about, Charlie felt the urge to take off into the air himself. After all, he too was a bird. But such attempts always came to a sad end. When they saw how depressed he was, the other birds would pretend that they didn't know how to fly either. But it was all in vain. Charlie continued to be sad. One day, he told his troubles to Professor Balthazar. Balthazar realized that something had to be done. He went home and thought, and thought, and thought. And then he had the solution. Professor Balthazar invented the penguin propeller cap. As soon as Charlie put it on his head, a propeller would start up and lift him into the air. All day long, Charlie performed the most marvelous stunts for his astonished cousins. And when night came, he was so tired, he literally fell into bed. 
Every day he got better at flying. He even flew over to Professor Balthazar's house to thank him. Charlie felt the call of faraway places. He flew further and further, even across the sea. But he would always return at bedtime. One day it was time for spring cleaning at the zoo. It was closed to the public so that everything could be properly cleaned, tidied and prepared for the new zoo season. This was his opportunity to fly even further, further than he had ever dared venture before. He flew off and he didn't come back. Everyone was very sad, most of all Professor Balthazar. So he started off to look for Charlie. And he found him, far away in the middle of the Polar Sea, on a small island in Penguin Land. But he was not alone. With him was Charlotta, a pretty girl penguin. Charlie had found the love of his life, but Charlotta couldn't fly. This was no problem for Professor Balthazar. There was no end to the rejoicing, both in the town and in the zoo. And Charlie and Charlotta now did their famous dance as a twosome, which in the unanimous opinion of everyone in Professor Balthazar's town was twice as jolly. 